If you've ever wished you could automate all those repetitive tasks in your business, like sending emails, tagging contacts, or delivering content, you're in the right place. Today, I'll show you how workflows and ClickFunnels make it easy to create seamless, automated experiences for your customers while saving you time and effort. Whether it's onboarding new users, managing leads, or delivering personalized offers, workflows are an absolute game changer. So let's hop in. Let me show you how it works. To get started, you first want to make sure you have your Automations app installed. If you do not see it, go ahead and click on Add Apps. Locate Automations and add it to your apps. Once you have done so, click on Automations and then click on Workflows. Next, you want to go ahead and click on the Add Workflow button. Go ahead and give your workflow a name and select your run type. As you can see here, there are three types multiple runs per contact, simultaneous, multiple runs per contact back to back, and only one run per contact. The simultaneous option triggers multiple actions within the workflow at the same time for a single contact upon meeting the trigger condition. For example, sending an SMS and email simultaneously when someone subscribes. Back to back allows a contact to re-enter the workflow if they meet the trigger condition again. Example, someone abandons their cart multiple times. And only one per contact ensures a contact only goes through the workflow once, even if they meet the trigger condition multiple times. For example, a welcome email sequence. Once you select your run type, go ahead and click Create Workflow. To begin building your workflow, you need to add a trigger. A trigger is basically what needs to happen in order to get this workflow going. So we want to come over here and click on event type and select the event. As you can see here, it ranges from applying a tag to appointments being scheduled, people clicking on email broadcasts, opening them, sending them, things related to message hub and so much more. For this example, I'll go ahead and select opt-in. Next, I need to select which funnel this will be occurring on. And of course, which page in that funnel this will be occurring on. And in this case, since I will be asking for a name, I do not want to allow anonymous contacts, so I'll go ahead and toggle this option off. And since I am going to be running this immediately, I'll go ahead and make this active. And I could go ahead and click Save Changes. And it will give me a summary of everything I just selected. Once I confirm this is correct, I can go ahead and close this. Next, I need to select an action. In other words, what's going to happen once this workflow is triggered? To do so, I'll hit this plus sign and select from the options on the right-hand side. And as you can see, you have almost endless options here. Everything from setting a delay in case you don't want this trigger to happen immediately. You can delay it by minutes, hours, even days. You can trigger another workflow. You can create conditional goals tag contacts. You can even notify yourself or someone on your team every time a new lead comes in and so on. For this example, I'm going to select enroll customer in courses. And by doing so, of course, it's going to ask me which course I would like to enroll them in. I'll go ahead and select which one and hit create step. So now when someone opts into this funnel, I select it here. It will trigger this workflow and immediately enroll them into the course I selected here. Now that I'm ready to start using this workflow, I can enable it by clicking the status switch and toggling it on. Once the pop-up comes up, I'll go ahead and click enable. Once people begin to go through this workflow, we will little by little start to see analytics here. Now, another way you can attach a workflow is at a funnel level. To do so, I can hover over the funnel step I want to use and click on the lightning icon. Here I can select an existing workflow or click on new workflow and create one like we just did in the previous steps. I'll go ahead and select one. I'll still need to select a trigger. In this case, I'll do opt in and then click attach workflow. Then I can choose to add more actions if I would like to. Then once set, I can go ahead and back out. Now the funnel still will indicate it has a workflow attached to it by displaying these green envelope icons. And there you have it. Now, I would like to cover a few frequently asked questions we receive. 
like how many workflows can I create? Is there a limit? ClickFunnels offers a generous plan, and at the moment, there are no limits to the number of workflows you can create. Can I connect a single workflow to multiple funnels? Absolutely, you can actually leverage the power of a single workflow across many funnels within your account, which eliminates the need of having to recreate them over and over again. Do I still need a separate email autoresponder software if I use ClickFunnels workflows? Nope, not at all. In fact, ClickFunnels workflows are much more advanced than your traditional email autoresponder software. Can I have multiple triggers for a single workflow? Absolutely, you can have a workflow initiate by multiple triggers. For example, you can have the same workflow be triggered by someone opting into a funnel, by purchasing a product, even abandoning their cart. Can I pause or stop a workflow after it started? Absolutely, even after your workflow is flowing, you can actually go into the settings, pause it, make any adjustments you need, and reactivate it. Can I integrate workflows with external applications? Absolutely, ClickFunnels offers a wide range of integrations with various third-party tools. And that's the magic of workflows in ClickFunnels. With just a few clicks, you can create automated sequences that not only save you time, but also ensure that your customers have an exceptional experience. From sending welcome emails to managing advanced follow-ups, workflows are here to make your business run smoother and smarter. Now it's your time to put workflows into action and watch your business thrive.